Have you ever thought about dumping all the entire world's trash into a volcano so you do not have to worry about burning them? Sounds a great idea, right? Let nature take care of the trash. Well, it is a cool idea, but will that really work? Hello, and welcome to a new episode of Random Thoughts. Today, we are going to learn about why don't we throw trash in volcanoes. So gather all your attention here and come with us to explore this interesting journey under the layers of the Earth. A volcano is a rupture in the crust of a planetary mass object, such as Earth, that allows hot lava splatter, volcanic ash, and poisonous gases to escape from a magma chamber below the surface. Do you know how hot the volcano lava is? It is 700 and 1,200 degrees centigrade, about 1,300 to 2,200 Fahrenheit, when first ejected from a volcano vent. It is true that it burns and melts everything that comes in its contact just like fire, that doesn't mean you go there for camping to toast some marshmallows. It'll burn you too. You must be wondering, if the lava can eat you, why can't it remove every last bit of the trash? Well, let us tell you that there are only 1,500 potentially active volcanoes in the world. While the world generates at least 3.5 million tons of plastic and other solid waste a day. Moreover, a lot of cities are thousands of kilometers away, for obvious reasons. So what do you think how much will this process cost? From gathering the world's trash and transporting it to all the volcanoes, it'll be highly expensive and who knows, the world might die under debt. Even if we did, not only will it be costly, but also the shipping distance would increase the carbon footprint of the waste disposal by magnitudes. That means we will massively pollute the local environment, plus we will give climate change a huge helping hand too. Some of the industries make electricity by the heat that is produced when the trash is burned in incineration plants. If the trash will be thrown into volcanoes, the electricity charges may cost you a leg and an arm. Still, what do you think? Can people use volcanoes nearby their living as their trash can? Not really. Not all of the volcanoes are active like we are on social media. Most of them are just like mountains and might have puddles of water than lava, so you might have to wait for it, or you might just drill down to magma chamber and then dump all your trash. Well, it is not as easy as it may sound. Lava is as dangerous as it looks. You might not know how will the volcano react when it will be drilled. It can cause a destructive explosion of lava up to 80 meters or more into the air. This seems a terrible idea to peek in a volcano. There are different kinds of volcanoes, and what we might be looking for is a Kilauea volcano that is constant and erupts calmly, but they are rare. More common ones are the explosive stratovolcanoes that explode due to the heavy buildup of the pressure of hot magma. You definitely do not want to have your house nearby. What if we find a Kilauea volcano? It might seem a safer way to get rid of all the trash, but not every substance just burns. It retaliates too. In simpler words, some materials like food scraps or leftover foods, when hit the lava, they do not burn, they explode. There's a whole science behind it why this happens. You might already have experimented pouring water into the hot oil. Have you noticed how it reacts? The water splatters and boils when it hits the hot oil. Similarly, any kind of liquid or wet thing in the garbage will react in the same way, resulting in an explosion. Suppose that we dump tons of waste into a volcano. What do you think will be the consequence? A lot of experiments are performed to question this answer. Some have experimented throwing phones in the volcano that didn't even break down completely, and some experimented with bags of food, and it is seen that volcano bubbles them in and they explode. You can search for various experiments on the reaction of the volcano to different materials and you will see hundreds of videos. Non-explosive materials, like plastic, might easily be melted in the lava, but is it something that we should really practice? You must be aware of the fumes and smoke that releases when plastic and styrofoam is burned. Some of these gases are ozone, carbon monoxide, sulfur dioxide, and are lethal to humans, animals, environment, and even destructs the ozone layer that protects the world from global warming. If we throw these materials into the volcano, the gases released will result in rapid climate change likewise. These materials can still be burned, but what about nuclear fuel or sterilized medical waste? These are specialized waste that cannot melt at the temperature of lava. The lava is very hot, but not enough to melt this waste. Nuclear waste is disposed by using it to produce electricity, while the medical waste is treated with chemicals, microwave radiations, and irradiations. 
This is a random fact that we found for you. If you enjoyed this video, do like, share, and comment down below. Your questions for us to answer and tell us what do you think? Do you still believe that throwing the trash into a volcano would be a smart act? Don't forget to subscribe for more upcoming videos where we will entertain and educate you with interesting information and facts you might be unaware of. And turn on the notification bell to never miss any video.